Listen, some mini things are good. Don't be gross. Like a new series called Rubik's Minis where we give you like a tr good, maybe a lot of helpful information in a little bit of time. Candy bars, the mini candy bars on Halloween. They're not good. Give me the full size candy bar. Why did you even think to make that? It pisses me off. Steve Weiner from GetRubix.com, and in this Rubix Mini, we're going to show you a few shortcuts on how you can see the installed apps on a PC, both locally and remotely. One trick I always do, and, and, and people don't seem to know it, is you, know, you open Run, and you hit Windows key R, and you type in appwiz.cpl, and that takes you right to the control panel of all the programs and features installed. So. If you want to see something, you want to manually uninstall it. Someone has something they they shouldn't have. Don't judge me. That's critical. And you can uninstall it from here. Usually click, hit uninstall, repair, sometimes uninstall change. Now, let's say you want to run a command. You want to deploy this from Intune or do it with PowerShell. Really easy, right? We don't do get WMI object anymore. We're not supposed to do that. So instead, we're going to do get stim instance win32 underscore product. And that's going to give you this list of all the applications. They're in a really nice table, but you know how we do it, right? If you want to uh, take anything from PowerShell and get it in a nice view, you could do out grid view, but only amateurs type out grid view. If you want to be the real deal, you type OGV, OGV. So we're going to type OGV. And then you get that same list in a nice table that PowerShell puts in for you. You can filter, you can search for things, do whatever you want to do here. And now you got all this information to play with. Hopefully that's some stuff you didn't know. If you want to chat, jump in the discord link below and we'll be seeing you.